This film really is about transformation and change. If you look at the arc of Pete's life, it's really incredible. He went from street hustler and pimp to Black Panther to community organizer. One of the most surprising things in making this film was witnessing Pete's shift in attitude regarding his legal case. Here you had this man who's had this long-standing uh, battle with America. And in many ways, the, the legal case um, was the fight who defined who he was. And I think by the end of the film, you see Pete reaching a monumental decision about um, his identity and his homeland and where he belongs. And he basically gives up the fight that defined who he was. You know, and he, he decides to live squarely in the present. Right now, in the third act of, of his life, He's leading an incredibly productive life. This is the age when a lot of people are considering retirement. And here's this guy who's opened up his home to really the international community, not just local Tanzanian, the hundreds of people who he you know, feeds and serves and, and gives water to um, in Tanzania, but to the international community. I'd hope that people are inspired by that and, and that they, whatever you feel about Pete, Pete's character, about the Black Panthers, about, about the Black Power Movement, about the 1960s, that you can look at this man and say he's led an incredibly productive life and in many ways admirable.